This is Heather with K Tom Restaurant Supply, and today I'll be teaching you guys how to make perfect gourmet chocolate covered strawberries just in time for Mother's Day. She's gonna love it, you guys. You'll be needing some big honking strawberries, uh, two different types of chocolate, preferably white chocolate and dark chocolate. You can use milk chocolate, uh, just if it's her taste, but my mom likes dark chocolate, so that's what I'm using. An optional you can use some cake sprinkles, like these pearls, to make the strawberries look even better. I'd like to add a quick note about uh, melting chocolate. Chocolate's a very finicky medium to work with and can easily burn or get to the wrong temperature. When you're melting your chocolate, um, use a double boiler. I know we have a great two-quart double boiler on our website. You should really look at or you could use a microwave. Now, before you go microwaving your chocolate half to death, um, just keep in mind that, like I said, it's very finicky, it will burn, and you might want to do it in 10 to 15 second increments with a lot of stirring to get um, equal heat in there. We're just going to take and dip right like that into the chocolate. Get it all nice and covered there. Don't be afraid of the chocolate. And then just take it up and let all that excess chocolate drip off of there. And lay it down on some wax paper. Now that we've got our strawberries dipped, it's time to let the chocolate harden. Uh, to quicken this process, we can take them and we can put them in the freezer. No longer than just a few minutes though, you guys, or won't be all that great. They don't have to be frozen, I promise. It'll harden pretty quick. Now that our strawberries have uh, got a hardened coat, we're going to decorate them, make them look extra awesome for Mama. Just go... good thing about these is that if it skips like that we can just take and fill it right on in. Perks of having a bottle. But doesn't that look nice? We can do the same thing with our dark chocolate ones. Now on this one I'm going to do a little bit of a different pattern. I'm just going to create straight lines going down. They don't have to be perfect. We'll just fill them in with our little hose there. There we go. Lines just going down. And then we'll go across. You know, be wary of your other strawberries <laughs> when you're doing this. All this excess will be gone when we pick them off the wax paper and you'll just see the pretty pattern. Now for this one, I'm just going to add little bitty dots of chocolate. Just very little bitty. Just around the strawberry. It's like painting with a bottle. Now that we have all these little places, we can take some of these awesome little pearls and place them directly in where the chocolate is. Drop that one. Now if you have a pair of completely fresh tweezers or something like that, not used or anything, you can use those and it'll greatly help your 
placing of these. I don't, so I'm just going to put them in by hand. I have clean hands. I wash them. No worries. And that is how you make um, gourmet chocolate covered strawberries. Doesn't this look delicious? Oh no, let me, let me see. <laughs> it tastes delicious too. Until next time.